Hey everybody, I'm Raquel Eatman. Thank you so much for joining me with this, um, can I call it an episode or just call it a video? Uh, this is where I create content that is both uplifting and I hope inspiring for risk takers. And if you're new to my, uh, my channel or to my newsletter, thank you for being here. I'm glad you're here. Today I am talking about how to deal with toxic people. And the first thing I want you to do is to really think about this question. Who are you to call someone toxic? Right? Who am I to say, I'm so sick of these toxic people type of thing. What I'm doing when I say that is I'm putting, I'm pitting me against them. And I'm saying that I'm better than them. I'm saying all of these things by calling someone out in a negative manner. Now they may very well be toxic. <laughs> they may be a hater and all of this stuff, whatever, but I want to really change the language. <laughs> I know I should probably stop this video and start all over again, but normally I keep going with these and I'm going to keep going with this because I have a point to make. I really think that, um, when people have a behavior that is different, or their morals are different, then that's all it is. And I'm not saying that I'm better than, I don't want any part of that, but notice the chatter that happens if you go to a friend or a colleague and you start whispering about, I've got to get away from this group. They are so freaking toxic. And when you say that, you get five people immediately. They come over like ants on a cupcake. They come over like, what happened? What'd they say? then you start to inspire that whole type of feeling and it's a negative place to be in. So it's best to say nothing about someone that's toxic or a hater or whatever it is. They're just different and my needs are different and I'm just going to go someplace else that can source my needs. So think about it that way. Yeah. And think about as I, uh, here we go. It's all kind of things happening with this video, but I'm going to keep going because this point is important. So think about toxicity and all of those things really differently and be careful of not pitting yourself against another group. We've got too much of that happening in the world already. And I would ask you to please just reconsider how you move through the world and, um, and, and break down barriers and break through and become, you know, a bridge person and all of the stuff that I know so many of you are doing. Let's just think about how we talk up people that um, seem to have a, a bit more negative energy in the world. I'd love to hear how you feel about this. Comment below. Let me know what you think about reframing how we look at toxic people or haters. All right. Great stuff. This is great. This stuff is empowering for us. It will empower you to take that language back and then you're not using as much energy, putting it out there. You're really just moving through the world very, very differently very, on a very high note as well. All right. So please like and share this video. If you haven't already subscribed to my newsletter, please do. I'd love to have you.